What's up everybody, I'm the Mim Sky, and welcome back to the official Beyblade Burst season. And this is the battle season, that team battle season to be exact. And today we have the Fiery Flames versus the Iron Defense. The team captains for both teams are Spryzen and King Kirbyus. And they'll be picking to see who goes out in their their battles. They must win a total of three three rounds. And that means they have to win two battles per round. It's two points a round. So for example, if Sparson knocks out King Kirbyus and he was the burst finish. The first round goes to, and the first battle goes to Spartan. That means their overall team point score has one, po one point, and they need to defeat three other bays. It could be a repeat of the same base bay, so they could send Spartan could send a, a new person, and King Kirbyus could stay in. So it's all up to the, uh, it's all up to the captain's choice. So let's get started. So on the Fiery Flames, we have the team captain Esprizen, and the rest of the team is Rantaro Giamas Bay, which is Ractivore, and Lost Luminor. And on the Iron Defense, we have the team captain King Kirbyus with on the rest of their team Wakius Bay, which is Wyvern, Wyvern and Red Arrow. So let's get started and see who the team captain chooses out to put out first. So the Iron Defense team the Iron Defense Captain King Kirbyus decides to shoot to put oh Wyvern out first. He's a defense type, and those are his parts. And from the Fiery Flames, Spryson decides to send out Ractivore, and those are his parts. He's a stamina type. So let's get started within the first battle. The first battle will be about to two points. Wyvern will be going first. They're about to go for his center, and Ractivore was knocked out of the arena by Wyvern. The first point goes to Wyvern. Wyvern takes the center, but now Ractivore takes the center. And ooh, another ring out finish made by Wyvern. So the first point goes to the Iron Defense. The Iron Defense team. The Iron Giants quickly send out, or not the Iron Giants, the Iron Defense quickly sends out their next teammate to go out, and it's Red Arrow. These are his points. He is a attack type, or these are his uh, parts. He's an attack type. And... The Fiery Flames sends out one of their best. On out, Lost Lunor. He is a attack slash stamina type. And here are his parts. Lost Lunor will be going first, so 3, 2, 1, go. Shoot. Ooh, powerful launch, maybe like Lost Lunor. But, can let Red Arrow keep its ground and from all these attacks from Lost Lunor. Ooh. Small hits. It's gonna come down to the sound now. Let's see who's going to win. And surprisingly, Red Arrow takes the first win. With a spin finish. The old guys are just as good as the big and heavy ones. No wonder he's on the iron defense. 
So red arrow going up first now. So three, two, one, go. shoot! Oh, I put it on the wrong thing. Oh, whoops. Hang on. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. He's in. So is Lost Lunar, and he's ready to rip Red Arrow right out of there. But Red Arrow's st standing his ground and look like uh, he's worn down. Lost Lunar is a little worn down. Red Arrow's stamina, and Lost Lunar now has a spin finish under his points. One more. They're both tied up. Now they just need one more point. Either one to win their team a point. Three, two, one, go shoot! Oh! That does not count considering the second bay has not entered the stadium yet. So there will be a respin for Lost Lunar. So, let me fix the stadium real quick. There we go. Three, two, one, go. shoot! Again! My goodness. Three, two, one, go shoot! There we go, finally doesn't go off. And they're both in now. Whoa! And Lost Lunar wins the flaming the fiery flames a point. Let's see who they send out next. The fiery flames sends out their captain, Spryzen. He is a balance type. Here is his parts. And the Iron Defense sends out their bay, which is surprisingly uh, Wyvern, which we've already seen his, he's a great defense type. You would think they would send out their captain, King Kerbius. Well, no, they sent out Wyvern. Now let's see how this battle goes down. Surprise and we'll go first, so three, two, one, go shoot. And Wonky tries to go for it in for attack, but misses. And now he's going in for the center and knocks out Spryzen. Really surprising there. So, Wyvern has one point underneath his belt for a ring out finish. And we'll be studying the next battle. So, three, two, one, go. Shoot! Whoa, Spryzen going in for a high attack, but also misses. If he had landed that hit, he would have knocked Walkie, uh, Wyvern out of the arena. But instead, he just knocked himself out of the arena. If I can find his bay. Out of the arena. Giving the Iron Defense another point. So now, the team's points are scored with the Iron Defense with... Two points overall, and the Fiery Flames with one point overall. They'll have to pick, the Fiery Flames will have to pick their next player very wisely to see who is going to win the next round. Because if they do, if they lose, if the Fiery Flames loses their next round to the Iron Defense, the Iron Defense will be better than them within their individual team matchups. And the Fiery Flames sends out Spryzen, their team captain. To see what the Iron Defense sends out next. And the Iron Defense sends out Red Arrow. Let's see how well this battle's going to go down. Is Red Arrow going to take a spin finish? Two times, or is Spryzen going to knock out Red Arrow with a burst finish? Spryzen will go first, so three, two, one, go. Shoot! Shoot! Oh! And it's a ring out finish for Spryzen. So Spryzen takes the first point. If you can get another one, he'll even up out the, the points between each team. Second battle, three, two, one, go, shoot! 
shoot. And whoa, okay. Red Arrow just knocks him out of the stadium. Just, he runs off the edge and it's knocked out, giving the fiery flames, and uh, even turning points together with, what? <laughs> The fiery flames and the iron defense are now even with their overall points. Let's see who they send out next. And the iron defense sends out their team captain, King Kerbius. Here is his parts. He's mainly a defense type. And the fiery flames send out their dragon destroyer, Lost Luinor. Here are his parts, and let's get started in the battle. It's the first battle, and since it's the final battle and they're tied up, it'll be a battle for three points. Three, two, one, go shoot! Uh. And Lost Lunar falls off the stage. It falls out of the arena, giving King Curvius first point. And he didn't have to do anything. Second battle. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Shoot. And they're going back to back in the center and that is a tie between the two. Hmm. Let's see who's going to take the third battle point. Nobody took the first battle. Or King Kirby took the first battle. Nobody took the second battle. Let's see who takes the third battle. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Shoot! And, oh, that was close for Lost Lunar. He almost fell out of the arena there. And now they're just trading off hits, and it looks like King Kirby is just drained. No way! No way! Lost Lunar just won, just by barely was a survivor finish. Lost Lunar takes his first point in the third battle. Let's go to the fourth battle to see who will win the second point. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! I thought that was a powerful launch, was it? Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Shoot! And, oh, that was close for King Kirby. It almost fell off the edge there. And now they're both slowly trying to make it towards the center. And oh, King Kirby is knocks Lost Lunar off the edge. King Kirby now has two points from the first and the fourth battle, while Lost Lunar only has one point from the third battle. If King Kirby wins this next point, he has won his team one point overall before the Nationals tournament. Three, two, one, shoot. Oh, and Lost Lunar is fast on that and takes out King Kerbius. Wow. So now they are both tied up. Let's see if who's going to win. Is King Kerbius going to make a comeback and hit Spryzen off the edge? Spryzen, no. Lost Lunar off the edge. Or is King Kirby, or is Lost Lunar going to do the opposite? So let's see. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Ooh, not a strong launch made by Lost Lunar. Let's see how much stam he's going to have to hold up. Ooh, and it looks like that may just spun him up. Oh, no, it didn't. And the Iron Giants take the first... The first win over the Fiery Flames. This is a sad, disappointing loss for the Fiery Flames. And the Iron Giants will be moving on. And they gain a point.